Jennifer, nice to meet you. How are you? Oh, I get to shake her hand. I know you must be tired after last night. Yeah, so yes, it was a lot of fun. I was amazed when you said Clark. I didn't know. I thought you were maybe a you Nick know, fan all year. I, I was a Nick fan all year, and I was a Clark fan all year. Wow. Um, and in that moment, you know, he said Nick, so I figured I'd say Clark, and you know, right, keep it. Like you know, that. we got we got to keep it even. We're judges. We're yes. not supposed to like be biased in any way right. but at the end of the day either one of them would have won I would have been very happy I think they were both worthy and I'm really happy that Nick won I think he's a he's a perfect American Idol like I said the night before he's right. the epitome of why that show was created yeah. he has the the chops the looks the the commercial kind of quality that American Idol and that America loved and yeah. which is why they chose him so bring what brings you here today I saw that commercial um, I just always love the cause you know like I said children and women's causes is what the Lopez Family Foundation is all about and um, healthcare is a big, big initiative for us um, with telemedicine. And, and we got that idea from the Children's Hospital of Los Angeles and working with the doctors there, like Dr. Siegel and, and the staff at Children's Hospital. So probably the most unfair thing in the world is to have a sick child and to have to deal with that and to help these parents and, and their kids and make sure that they have the best health care that they can have. Right. They're pulling us away, I just have to say, yes. Vegas. Yes. It's going to be exciting, It's right? going to be super January. exciting. Get yes. the tickets Saturday, yes. right? <laughs> we got it. Uh, thanks for stopping. Woo, my favorite.